What's up, YouTube? It's me again, just giving you an update on the 454. Um, thinking it's looking pretty damn good. Look, look at this. Got my intake on. Got the heads on. Um, got the balancer back on. And uh, this intake is... Uh, I shelled out a little more for the polished finish on the Pro Comp intake. Uh, I've, I've worked with the Pro Comp one intakes before and they, they do pretty good. The only thing I didn't like about this, and I got to give you guys a heads up, is uh, these intakes came pretty, pretty nasty out of the box. Um, what I mean by nasty is that it still had polish on it. Um, it wasn't even polished all the way. I don't know if you could see that detail or not. That right there is. Uh, just not a good finish neither is this luckily it's on the back uh, there was a couple other areas where it wasn't perfect but I uh, did some hand polishing with uh, some others polish and trust me this looks a lot better than what came out of the box um, I'm happy with it though I mean you compare a Pro Comp polished intake to an Edelbrock polished intake and you'll see what I'm talking about about a hundred and hundred and fifty dollar difference but um i'm happy how the way it turned out uh got a couple more things need to get i'm um, gonna definitely get some pulleys i got my water pump hanging out over there ready to go on and got my uh flex plate on the way got a carburetor and yeah not too much to go on not too much to go to fire this guy up. Can't wait till it's in there. Yeah, it's going to look pretty sick. Um, I'm actually going to go to a car show this weekend and uh, show it off with the Pontiac engine, which still needs to be detailed a little more. But hopefully this is uh, in maybe in a couple weeks. Um, leave your comments, all right, guys? Thanks.